The Wabash Valley's most accurate and reliable newscast continues with Storm Team 10 meteorologist Lindsay Monroe. Good afternoon, everyone. After some of us starting off with some dense fog across the valley, we are looking at clearing skies, plenty of sunshine for the next several hours. That is certainly going to warm up those temperatures. We're down to 69 degrees with a calm wind. Humi uh, humidity is low. We are looking at a fantastic November day shaping up once again. Here were those. Here's where those clouds were in place over the past several hours throughout our westernmost counties. We're talking about Mattoon to Effingham, where there's still a little bit of cloud cover in place. Temperatures are hindered a bit near 58 degrees in Mattoon right now. 56 in Effingham, but warming up nicely for everyone else who's under the sunshine. 68 in Robinson, 67 up in Paris and Vincennes, checking in at 69 degrees. For the rest of your election day temperatures, we are going to continue to rebound back near 71 by 1 p.m. and highs topping out near 74 heading through the afternoon. These numbers well above average. We should be near 61 for this time of year, exceeding that by nearly 10 to 15 degrees in many locations. Even heading into the evening to Tonight, temperatures are going to stay pretty comfortable as we start to drop back through the 60s near 65 degrees by 8 p.m. Forecast highs today again going to be a little cooler the farther west you are because of that leftover cloud cover topping up near 71 in Mattoon, but 74 in Robinson up to 75 in Linton and the Goatee 76 degrees. Certainly going to be a warmer day overall for most of us, even Rockville up to 74 this afternoon. There's that leftover cloud cover that will continue to erode as the day progresses. High pressure in control for the rest of us, so we stay dry for today. In fact, this dry stretch will last all the way through Thursday evening before we track off that next weather system that will bring the return of rain. So beginning future cast at midday today, notice that the clouds again continue to erode back to our west and the sky stays clear for our evening commute home. Here's 5 o'clock and even for the evening tonight, we keep that clear sky around, putting us all the way through around midnight tonight. It is going to be a very nice evening. Perhaps you still need to get out and rake some leaves, do a little yard work. Today will be a very nice day to do that. 67 by 7 p.m. dropping to 64 by 9 and back to 62 by 10 o'clock. More clouds are going to start to return through the overnight, so it will be a little more mild for us. Now turning as chilly with lows dropping back into the lower 50s across the board. Clouds lifting in from the south. We'll begin this at mid night tonight and then watch the clouds from the Ohio River Valley start to build back in to the Wabash Valley cloud cover about uh, to, uh, 24 hours from now. We will be talking about partly cloudy skies rain free though. This weather model trying to pick up on a spot of rain or two. I do think the atmosphere is going to be just a little too dry for that to actually hit us, so we will call it a dry day, partly cloudy through the day on Wednesday. Clouds are going to stay fairly abundant through the overnight. That's put that's uh, putting us into our Thursday morning here 7 a.m. But notice what's going on back to our west. Yeah, our next rain system is starting to gather strength here. It's a cold front. It is going to move through eventually come Thursday evening through about Friday morning. So most of the day on Thursday is going to be dry, partly cloudy with that rain set to move in late Thursday evening lasting through our Friday morning. That's going to be followed up by some cooler temperatures as we head into next weekend. So your forecast for this afternoon, plenty of sunshine is expected and warmer than average temperatures. Again, we talked up by about 10 to 15 degrees. 74 your forecast time through the overnight tonight. We'll start to see a few more clouds fluctuating in. Otherwise, even some patchy fog possible, probably not as widespread as what we had around this morning, mainly because the clouds will be around. That sometimes hinders fog development. Just keep that in mind, though, for tomorrow morning, 52 your overnight low. And then another warm day tomorrow with a high back near 74 on Wednesday, staying warmer on Thursday as well with a high near 72. Rain returns late in the day. It continues through Friday afternoon and then it turns cooler. Looks like by Friday night we will be dry. Temperatures drop back near 41 degrees heading into the weekend, Saturday and Sunday dry with highs in the 50s.